everyone. Dawn Candy with I Promote You. Uh, we are here today for our business spotlight with Ruby Bolton. Welcome, Ruby. Thank you so much. I You're appreciate welcome. your coming out. You're welcome. We're so excited to be here. Ruby is an attorney here in the Woodlands area, Bolton Law, correct? Yes, so I yes. wanted her, I met her at a recent chamber event, wanted her to introduce herself to you guys, let you know the type of law that she does and how she, she might be, be on. Um, my name is Ruby Bolton. I am the founding attorney of the Bolton Law Firm. I'm board certified in family law. Family law is divorce, child custody, paternity, premarital agreements, anything dealing with a marriage, a dissolution of marriage, or raising of children. So, um, what a difficult um, situation, someone going through divorce or the child custody situation, and, and I can hear your care and concern in your presentation here. Um, it, so can people reach out to you if they happen to have any questions? Maybe they're not really sure how to navigate the system and where to even begin, um, things like that. You know, a lot of times these are not, um, these aren't knee-jerk reactions right. of having a divorce. They've had trouble. Um, they know that it's going to be a difficult process. Um, so can they turn to you guys and reach out um, and just kind of ask you for a, a consultation or how does that work? Absolutely. So there are some people who wake up one day and they, they know that they have to get divorced. Maybe it's because they've been served with papers or some situation has developed and it's just obvious that that's what has to happen. I would say though that for most people who end up in a divorce, there's a period where what they're doing is they're looking at options and uh, evaluating, is this what I want to do or if this happens, if we're not able to work things out, what will I be looking at? Mm -hmm. And uh, absolutely, I have people come in all the time who want to know if this happens to me, will I lose my company? I have a family owned business. Does my spouse have, will they take a part of that with them? Um, if we have children, my, my spouse says, uh, because I cheated, I'm going to lose custody. Am I going to I'm, am I going to lose my children? Is that what I'm facing? And sometimes there are really important questions and people just need to know what are the family law courts of Texas like and, and what will I be facing? We take client confidentiality extremely seriously. Not only is, uh, are the details of your case confidential, but your name is confidential. The fact that you scheduled an appointment with us is confidential. Nobody will ever know that you came in and met with one of our attorneys. Nobody will ever know what you're considering or what you're afraid of. If, if you've run into a member of my staff on the street where actually everybody's instructed, you don't acknowledge a client unless they acknowledge you first because we're very sensitive to the fact that we're helping people through a life crisis. Mm -hmm. And maybe, you know, you're out with friends and you don't want to deal with your divorce or, or your custody battle. Right. You don't want to be thinking about it right then. Mm -hmm. We're going to respect that. That's wonderful. Um, and I know your clients appreciate that very much. So you also practice not only in Montgomery County, Harris County, but the state of Texas? I mean, could you help somebody that is... Well, that depends on how far away you are. Okay. So, I charge for travel time. Okay. And so, if you were to come to me and say, you know, I'm facing a situation in Lubbock, you know, I'm going to respect your time and your money too much to to be your attorney in that case. Mm -hmm. uh, I would refer you out. Now, I go on a fairly regular basis to Grimes County, Waller County, Fort Bend County. Okay. Harrison, Montgomery definitely take up the bulk. But even if you're not within the area that we serve, if what you want to know is what should I anticipate, what should I expect, yeah. I'd be happy to, to sit down and talk with you. And, you know, um, I belong to a lot of family law attorney networks. Uh, board certification is a, exactly, a, is actually a fairly rare thing in the state of Texas. Less than one out of 100 attorneys is, is board certified in family law. And I can refer you to somebody else who's really going to know what they're doing and mm -hmm. take very good care of you, even if you're not in my practice area. 
And again, I appreciate that because uh, you actually know the people you're referring them to. So that's usually, wonderful. Usually, usually, yeah. if I don't, yeah. if I don't, let's say you're going to El Paso, I don't personally know an attorney in El Paso, but I will know somebody who knows an attorney in, sure. in El Paso, and I will be sending you to someone that is recommended by someone that I respect. Right. That's great. So um, thank you guys for tuning in. Ruby, we so appreciate you spending some time with us today. We're going to make sure that we include Ruby's information um, on this video. And so we thank you guys for tuning in today, and we hope you'll tune in next time. I'm Dawn Candy with I Promote You.